3-0 win at Loyola Marymount. That's back-to-back -back triple goal games. Um, second of three home games uh, coming up on Saturday mm -hmm. against mm -hmm. UAB. Yeah, real happy with uh, periods of our play. I thought the last two games we've gotten uh, really good results, had some great play. And, and, and then, you know, I think just like the rhythm of most games, the, the, there's moments that I wouldn't say get away from us, but they, they even out. Um, coming off uh, three road trips in a row, I, I, I thought our performance Saturday night versus Florida Atlantic, uh, I, I was really happy with it in that we got the result. I thought our first half, um, we played really well, played some of our best soccer of the year. Um, scored a late goal to, to go into halftime, one to nothing. And then I think the second half, just uh, kind of the travel and, and three games in eight days got the best of us. We, we, uh, there was a bit of a lull. Florida Atlantic, to their credit, played really well, got, got uh, a good bit of the game. And then uh, we closed it with, with, with two, uh, two really good goals um, for a 3-1 win. So to, to get through that uh, portion of our schedule with three wins, you know, with, on, on three consecutive road trips, I was really happy with our guys. I thought they did a, a, an excellent job. And you get rewarded, you know, you're at home. Uh, you get three in a row at home. Good to kind of get our legs back under us, catch up on school. Uh, and, and this is kind of the big push right now, you know, six, six games remaining. Um, is it four at home or three? Yeah, I think four of the six are at home. Some great opponents. UAB, who we play this Saturday night, is a very talented, attack-minded team. I think it's going to be a really exciting game. That, that was kind of our challenge to the guys today. Today was the, 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 the first time we'd kind of introduced the opponent. Um, talked about it a little bit, and, and, and it's a game that we have to be really disciplined defensively. We have to be good on the ball. They have some, uh, like I said, tremendous attacking players. But I think it's a good matchup for us. I think we press well. I think we want to play teams that want to play soccer against us. And um, UAB definitely will do that. They'll attack with big numbers. They're athletic. It, 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 it'll be a fun game to watch. And, and that's where our focus is now, just on the next one. And, and I'm happy with our team. I think we continue to get better. Ultimately, our success is going to be based on our ability to score goals. And um, we're, 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 we're getting goals from a wide range of players, which is a good thing. But we need our, uh, our top attacking guys to find the net. And, and, and I have the confidence that they will. So we will see Saturday. But uh, I like where we're at. The guys got some much needed rest the last couple of days, you know, some light sessions, and we get after it tomorrow. How do you keep that edge <coughs> that you have right now? How does it feel? I mean, it's a good question. I mean, I mean, I mean, an edge is with challenges and, and, and edges with uh, confidence and, and uh, desire to, to play and, and reach your potential and uh, get results. And this is a very driven team. And there's a lot of competition within the team. So it's, uh, th there's a lot of factors. But, but in terms of an edge, yeah, I think this group has a hunger to them, a passion to them, and uh, a commitment to continually improve every day. So I, I really like where we are and, and, and excited for the next game. You like how the schedule plays out, you know, because you, you knocked out these, these road games. Now you've got four of your net last six at home. And that's, you know, like you could really make up. Yeah, I mean, it's, it, it's a cliche, but it's, it's, you, you got to look at it one game at a time right now. You know, these are all top opponents. So we got to prepare for each one and, and have our focus on, 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 on that game. And, and, and I think our guys are, are good at doing that. But when you look at the, the, the whole, the, the big picture, yeah, it's a, it's a good one in terms of a good way to finish up at home. Do you think um, that Jason's not giving up many goals? Do you think Mike Gracic has a lot to do with that since he's come here? He's our all-time leader, Mike. Yeah. Because um, he's 
playing awfully good. Yeah, I'd say the majority of our goalkeeper training right now is done by Lucas Champenois from our staff. And Lucas was a very good Division I uh, goalkeeper. And Mike, you know, had, definitely has a great deal of influence. But, but Jason's a, a mature player. It's his fourth year here. And um, he's really developed into, I think, one of the top keepers in the country. Yeah. All right. Well, we're excited to see everybody Saturday night. It's going to be a good game. Hey, Coach Peters, in your opinion, best professional or amateur soccer player in the world right now, Cristiano or is it Lionel Messi? Cristiano Ronaldo. Why? Just his ability to score goals. Man, I, I just can't believe it right now, how, how well – he finds the net every game. I mean, I, I think it's a, a tough question, you know, because he's such a, a marquee player, at least for Portugal, you know, and he's scoring international goals. But, uh, I, yeah, that, that's my, my opinion. That's my opinion. Who's got the best cross? Who's the best passer in the game? Man, big questions. I don't know. Messi's pretty good, Christian you know? No. Ronaldo's a score, goal scorer. I think Messi's probably maybe a more complete player, brings more guys into the game, you know, but he's surrounded by some other scorers, you know. He's got Luis, you know, Suarez. He's got some big players around him. But uh, I think anybody would be happy with both those guys on their roster. All right, thanks a lot. Thank you.